Welcome back to my channel or welcome if this is your first time here. My name is Rebecca. Today's video is a pillow tabby review. We're gonna call it a six month review but I've had this bag since April which is seven months and I just wanted to do a review because I saw that they recently had them back in stock because this particular color was sold out for the longest but I think some stores I don't know if coach has it but I know like there's some department stores that have this and they also brought it out in a mini version which is kind of cute too actually uh, at one point I was contemplating buying it in a mini but it's such a trendy bag that I don't know two years from now if it's still gonna be like you know something that I want to keep this is a nice entry-level luxury bag not pricey at all I think I paid like $4.95 for this and I think the mini is even um, lower at a lower price point which is not bad at all um, to invest in I guess and I've seen that these are reselling for way higher because they are in high demand and because this particular ivory color is so rare right now but yeah guys seven months ago I got this coach Pito Tabby 26 in a color ivory or cream color it is still going strong I have worn it like crazy though I have worn this like crazy it is a an easy color to wear it is easy to pair with you know most colors like right now I'm wearing a brown shirt this is from H&M by the way and you know the contrast is looking good so you can wear black and wear this you can do white and wear this like it's just it's like a nude um, color so definitely easy to pair I love the C here I think it's what like sold me on this bag is the C and just the pillowish feel gives it that Bottega vibe. I believe the person who actually designed this worked for Bottega. So hence the resemblance and the inspiration. So these bags comes with a top handle or shoulder handle on other people. I feel like you gotta be really petite to gotta be able to be able to wear this on the shoulder. It's just a little too tight for me, so I don't I never wear it on the shoulder. I will handheld it. Or I'll hold it like this and then it also comes with a long strap this on the other hand you can shorten it because it's adjustable and then you I can because I'm 5'8 and then I can do it shoulder but most of the time I will either hand hold it or I will do the top um, or I will do the long strap and wear it as a cross body it has this luggage tag right here that says coach on it really really nice the leather is super soft oh my god like i already know coach is known for their craftsmanship they have amazing leather in general and this is this was a piece of art this was definitely a piece of art and these straps are removable so i previously purchased like a chain uh, strap from Amazon and occasionally I will like switch them up just to make it a little fun I would insert a picture for you guys but recently I have been carrying it with its original straps um, inside it is also a leather it's also a very soft leather in the same cream color and it has a zip compartment there which is lined my zip compartment talking about wear and tear my zip compartment is dirty but that's because i've put makeup in it in the past haven't cleaned it up yet i don't even know how to somebody mentioned previously that i can actually have coach uh clean this for me i guess i'll look into it but it doesn't bother me because that's really the compartment maybe when if i'm get ready to like resell it in the future then i can look into cleaning it up and it has this tag right there in a brown color that just talk about like coach this is 
um, a coach bag and all that you know good stuff so this is the chain that I bought from Amazon and sometime I will switch it up and wear it with this chain this bag doesn't carry a lot I have a previous video showing you guys what fit in this particular bag I'm gonna put it down below in the description box if you guys want to see what exactly can fit but I do have a uh, iPhone 12 Pro Max it can fit there I can fit my wallet in there um, a mask maybe a few makeup products maybe like a powder and a brush and like a lipstick but it doesn't fit much although it's like bulky it doesn't fit it just doesn't fit uh, a lot so Keep that in mind if you're getting this bag but I mean those are like my essentials so if you're somebody who like to carry a whole house out <laughs> this is not gonna work but if you carry your essential this is a cute number this this is gorgeous like this bag is definitely gorgeous seven months strong and I still like it in the beginning I wasn't sure if I was just falling for the hype and the trend and if I was gonna regret it or change my mind but I don't like I fall in love with it more and more every day so as far as um wear and tear this bag scratches I don't know I wouldn't say easily but it does scratch though I'm not the kind of person who baby my bags I don't baby, I don't baby my bags I'm not really careful with my bags like I am even like sometimes a little careless to be honest with my bags but it still looks nice I have like a pen mark somewhere though back here I don't know if you guys can see it back here there's like a pen mark right there um, the C the C on the buckle has a little discoloration there I haven't attempted to clean these yet so I don't know if they will clean but I'm assuming the wheel with like a leather conditioner or like somebody mentioned maybe if I send them to coach they will clean them out for me but I just don't feel like doing it just to bring it back and get it dirty <laughs> all over again um what else so other than like minor wear and tear of like a used bag I don't see anything like major though like it still looked nice there's another scratch here I don't know if that's like makeup or something but there's another little stain right here um the strap is still good no discoloration on the strap yet the buckles are still nice like all the hardware is still like this this rustic gold and it's still all intact and the color is still popping <laughs> um the inside got a little wrinkly but that I guess that happened with most leather bags because this is genuine leather high, high quality I think Italian leather so yeah it's soft and of course it's gonna wrinkle it a little bit so this comes in black it comes in I think green and like a like a lighter pink so yeah I think this is a gorgeous number I think this bag is amazing I think it's really beautiful and I think it's worth the hype yes i definitely think it's worth the hype and i think for the price point it is not bad at all coach is back though coach is back and they're back strong they have so many nice things like i literally want to purchase another bag from them and not my camera running out of space in the middle of me filming my video so like i was saying guys i will highly recommend this bag even though it is trendy right now and is a little much hyped up I think it's worth the hype in my opinion I might actually get myself the mini version in maybe like a black or a green for Christmas maybe that will be a Christmas present to myself we'll see so yeah guys check out the description box I'm gonna link this down below for you guys thank you for tuning in if you have a pillow tabby 26 or the mini bag or if you are thinking about purchasing it let me know down below and as always comment like subscribe join the family i'll see you guys in my next video bye guys i've been at it i've been at it on the low trapping out a while i keep seeing the leaders doing as we talking plans and maybe seeing you pull up on you let me school nobody here but me and you got a little ring to it turn a thing fluid in the coat